Bahamas. And this is the port of Nassau. And people have already started disembarkment. You see that's the port. And there's one more cruise line which is Carnival Sunshine in front of us. And this is how it looks from our balcony. It seems really fun. The port seems to be fun. And if you look there, that's how we disembark from the deck number one. is our line for the excursion. We are heading out to the Sinchil Naso. Our tourism is so important to us. 65% of our GDP derives either directly or indirectly from tourism. 65 cents of every dollar come from the tourism product here wow. in the Bahamas. Uh, we had that interruption with COVID. The country was locked down for a year and a half and we had no visitors coming to our shore. And that almost totally wiped out our economy here on the island. Okay guys, today the store is not about me, it's about you, so if you have questions, I should not be answered. In the peak of the weather, we'll have a few days of about 35 degrees, and then the heat trade back up, it is normal that you're feeling here today. Okay folks, I'm sure you see some work going on there at the pier. We are proud to say that Royal Caribbean is taking the lead in the whole revitalization of that port. But they're not doing it Enough. alone, they're getting help from all the other major they cruise lines. Like almost and they have an incentive yeah. to do so. Everybody has an island that will give it to them to do their own development here, their own productivity. Yeah. Once they finish, they can come back and redo some of these buildings for us. We'll set up for the person there. If you buy three or more boxes, that would give you a shot right here at this little bar. Yeah, you just present your cake in. This is rum cake factory. Kind of busy right now. We're waiting in the room. Soccer stadium right there. Americans call it sand soccer. It's actually beach soccer. But like in the far left, we have the reef here of this company. So if you own time here in Orlando, any 30 years until this bridge was built back in 1995. Uh -huh. Three photos of Sydney Point here. And on the right, that's a very famous Jimmy Buffett, Marguerite Deville. Uh -huh. We catered to the Canadian market, but recently we had a hold on a youth personal tapping into that area. That's because we have all the major airlines that fly from their city to the United States and they come here. So guys come for a couple of days and then they hear them. But on the island here, that's one property that remain independent to the operation of Atlantis. 
if you live there, the pricing is much cheaper, but yet you get to share in all the amenities offered at a lot of If you're traveling for an extended time, they have children in large groups. The children have full access to the marine park and the adults to the casino or anywhere throughout the hotel that they wish to go. This section here is called the Carl Tower Access to the Guys, in the Bahamas here, we don't do much production at all. 83% of our food source comes from the U.S. deals with the bank secrecy laws and the money laundering act. These parts you're not allowed to possess more than ten thousand dollars in your person unless you get authorization from the central bank. If you do so in the court with the money will be um, locked up and charged uh, with the money and for failing to declare it. You'll also do some time in jail for that ordeal. Uh, property there is the governor's mansion. All of our governor general resides there once they're in office. The present governor general is Cornelius Smith. He is out because the property is going through some renovation. They also have a statue there of one Christopher Columbus, who was said to discover the Bahamas back in 1492. In the Bahamas, we don't believe Columbus discovered nothing because he met people here. Only a hotel for all those years. Uh, the first structures would have burned down and then they rebuilt it and then they call it the um, Hilton, British Colonial Hilton. The Hilton stepped out of office yeah. about four months ago and left that place vacant. Wow. Uh, for a long oh. period, the property was offered by one Sahari Oaks. He was a prominent Canadian businessman who died mysteriously here in the Bahamas. His son-in-law was charged with his murder, but there wasn't sufficient evidence and they had released him. So that remains a murder mystery here on the condition. I'm not sure what they can do with it after they completed that building. But the Chinese came and set up shop right over here to the right. And now the U.S. Department saying the Chinese too close and intercepting their secrets. Yep, stealing their secrets. Yep, and right there, that property was also bought out by the Chinese in St. Margaritaville Beach Resort. It has nothing to do with Jimmy Buffett because the Chinese changed the spelling in the wording and so Jimmy couldn't even suit up for using his logo. Yeah, you can afford to or put an extra room or two on the house and use it for their burial. Still operational today, they keep it anxious, keep it just as is now. They have active funeral going on, that's another funeral. They haven't had one last week. So that is still operational today. 1726 in Mary the Virgin Church was established. And right ahead of us. it looks like on that display on Bay Street. Anytime you see a bright array of colors and you hear the sound of cowbell and goatskin drums, that is Chow Canoe. 
Okay, folks ahead of us here, that street is called Meeting Street because that's where the guys, once they were freed, freed slaves from talking about, were allowed to gather there to chart their way forward. Uh -huh. And we're now on the property of the Great Cliff, that's the old five-star restaurant, been around for many, many years. And the umbrellas in the air, that's a small winery of this establishment. If you want a sample bottle or a bottle modified for you for what purpose you're serving, you can check out right there at the um, right here. Uh, right there that blue sign is that's a small chocolate factory of this establishment, and the arrow that would point you in the direction of the cigar rolling company. Okay, guys, it'll be a lot of things. before we head back to the pier. Look at the color of water yeah. and this is amazing. Again, get a photo ID and your chip pass, that's all you need, and get your stuff and carry them with you. 